Satyabama Institute of Science and Technology. Hi all, this is Subhapriya, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science and Engineering, Satyabama Institute of Science and Technology. Our topic for today is Image Sensing and Acquisition. Before entering into our topic, let us see what is image processing. Image processing is a process of converting a normal image into a digital image in order to extract and useful information from that image. For converting this normal image into a digital image, we need an image. So, in order to capture an image, we need a sensor and in order to convert that image into an useful information, we need an acquisition. So, our topic for today is image sensing and acquisition. Images can be generated in a combination of an illuminating source and reflection or absorption of energy for that source by the elements of the scene to be imaged. The illuminating source could be a sun or any electromagnetic radiation such as radar, IR rays which means an infrared rays or an, an X-ray. Okay. Depending upon the nature of the source, the illumination energy is reflected from and transmitted into an object. This reflected or transmitted energy is focused in order to convert that energy into an visible light and in order to per perceive an image. For sensing an object, we are in need of sensors. There are three types of sensors. Number one, it is a single sensor and number two, it is a line of sensors and number three, it is an array of sensors. The single sensor is not, nothing but it is a sensor which contains a sensing material. On the top of the sensor, there is an light illumination source and we have a filter on a top of the sensor. The input energy or electrical energy is given as an input and the electrical energy in combination with the sensing material and an illuminated source, we get an uh, voltage form of the images. This is the aligned sensors where the single sensors is arranged in a form of a linear manner which forms the line sensors. The same sensors which is in the form of an array is nothing but the array of sensors. Let us see what is a single sensor. Image acquisition using single sensor is done in this process. Here a single sensor is mounted on a lead rod where it has a uh, cylindrical drum where the film roll is mounted on a cylindrical drum where this lead rod will be moving in a linear motion where the cylindrical drum moves horizontally. Then the images will be captured and the images will be acquired. The image acquisition using single sensor here the photodiode is the most common uh, type of the sensor. The output voltage is proportional to the light which is formed. Okay. This sensor where the filter which is on the top of that single sensor is it can be an a green pass filter which the output will be an a green light. The arrangement of the sensor as I said it is mounted on an a lead rod where there will be a cylindrical drum which is uh, rotating in an vertical direction and the sensors which is mounted on a lead screw will be rotating in an horizontal direction. The output of this acquisition using single sensor is nothing but a 2D digital image. Let us see an image acquisition using a sensor strip. This type of sensor is most commonly used in flatbed scanners. This is the uh, line of sensors where a sensor strip is mounted on an imaged area where this sensor will move in a linear motion where the image area will be in a perpendicular to the imaging area. The same thing is implemented in this type of for detecting and 3D images where the single sensor or line sensors are mounted in on a ring to in order to scan an object which is placed in between a ring as shown in the previous image. Okay. This produce an 3D objects through the captured image. Okay. This type of uh, sensors are used in medical and industrial imaging. This is an image acquisition using array of sensors. See the light which is illuminated from the nature source it can be a sun or an electromagnetic source can be like a radar or IR rays. The light illumination falls on the object which has to be uh, imaged okay and in turn the reflected light falls on an imaging system. In front of an imaging system there is a lens which pro projects this image into an image plane okay in turn which is converted into an digitized image.
this type of sensors is used in 2D image and it can also be used in an three dimensional images. This array of sensors is nothing but it contains uh, sensors which is packed in an array. It can be the array can be like 4000 cross 4000 and uh, the sensors it is called as an array of sensors. It is widely used in digital cameras for sensing the light instruments. Since the arrangement has 2D set of arrays of sensors, movement is also not required here. A complete image can be obtained by focusing the energy pattern onto the surface of the array. The recap of this session is, we are in need of capturing an image. How we are going to capture an image is via a sensors where there are three types of sensors which is nothing but the single sensor and a line of sensors and an array of sensors. After capturing an image, the image has to be acquired and where we are going to uh, take the meaningful information from an image. That meaningful information can be uh, taken via this array sensors, line sensors and the single sensors. Thank you.